life for the dead homies. Fuck you and your dead homies. I put dead homies on your head, homie. Appeal money for the fair homies. Ay, ay, ay. What's the deal? What's the deal? What's the deal? Your boy LB back with another one of them thank things, Mike. One time for the one time you know what it is up over here, eh? Check it out, though. Check it out. Today, today, my nigga, bringing him bike to the motherfucking stage. And God bless the motherfucking dead, bruh. Pimp motherfucking C. Knocking those down. Now, from what I understand, from what I remember, I think he had just got out of jail or went too long up out of jail when he recorded this and this was pretty much addressing all the negativity and the beef that was not only in the music industry but within Houston especially and a nigga was like coming in knocking those down like nigga let's quit this bullshit with you and this nigga let's quit that bullshit with you and him bro this is Houston bro this Texas let's get this motherfucking paper bro and I salute that message my nigga I think a lot of motherfuckers can actually learn from that especially this day and age you got too many rappers going to jail behind dumb shit. Too too many rappers getting getting killed behind dumb shit. Just too much, bruh. So maybe this whole industry need to knock start knocking those down, bruh. Bikes. time I heard that bar, I always thought was that a shot at T.I. Because I don't know if T.I. fucked with Pimp C or P.I. I mean, or Pimp C fucked with T.I. But I've always wondered that every time I heard that bar, because I could always say I'm the king of the south, king of the south. So, mm -hmm. With GIP, if them niggas come together, know how much paper we can see. Slim thug and zero, y'all still bullshit. Need to sit down, take a two. It's too much money to be get. Paul Wall and that Cooper still ain't talking. How much paper we can see. Slim thug and zero, y'all still bullshit. Need to sit down, take a two. It's too much money to be get. Paul Wall and that Cooper still ain't talking. Money speak, all that bullshit keep walking. Y'all niggas got the game fucked up. All your record company people need to shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Cause y'all keeping up that bullshit rapping. Mm. And white people laughing at us, that's what's happening. They saying stupid. And that's what it always is. It's an outside influence, an outside party that's always fucking up the main individual. I was, I was just watching the, un, the unsung with Cool Mo D. You feel what I'm saying? And, um,. He was talking about the whole shit with LL and how when they took a picture, I don't know if the lady was his manager or whatever she was, so probably just a photographer, how LL Cool J was like, he was known for the Kangos. So they took a Kango hat and put it under the Jeep tire like he running that shit over and that's kind of how a lot of shit blow out of proportion. Same shit with the Pac and Big, the East Coast and the West Coast. Wasn't no East Coast and West, West, West Coast, that magazine put that shit out. You feel what I'm saying? So it's always outside influences that fuck it up. But if you could let an outside influence you, where the fuck is your head at? Where are your antennas? But as niggas still ain't figured it out, long as they stay divided, man, we gon' run the side. Y'all need to get up off the dumb shit. I got a bread truck, get up off that crumb shit. I got the face quaking, trying to 
trunk shaking like tambourines. In the H, where the paint sweet as tangerines. Where they bouncing on foes like trampolines. It's the great state of Texas, so I can't believe all the conflict and plex that we carrying. It's time to get rid of the beef like vegetarians. I'm about stacking bank every day, so I pay attention to the vets, and I ain't talking about a Chevrolet. Kiki. Now we go say this before he said it, well after he said it, cause I didn't fucking know, although I know this song, that part kind of went over my fucking head. Cause I do reactions to Zero and Slim Thug, I think I did two songs they was on together. And to know that they had beef, bruh, that's some, I was like, damn. I didn't, I didn't even know them two niggas was tripping with each other like that, let alone what the fuck they was even tripping for, bruh. And Texas, how I always say they pay homage, cause, and, I think this song had a lot to do with the unity that I see in Texas. Not from, I'm not from Texas because a lot of motherfuckers think that, but I do a lot of reaction. I see a lot of unity and love and shit. And I kind of think this song had a hell of a lot to do with that. You feel me? Don Pimp C a King, Lil J the owner of the squad, Ace Time, we the team. It ain't no iron that you trying that you be fatigued. But if we man up and press, we can lead the league. We some all stars, the roster is sick, man. I ain't gotta start POP or be the six man. Drop a lot of Southern Empire for the assist, man. Three, two, one, switch and league. We some all stars, the roster is sick, man. I ain't gotta start POP or be the six man. Drop a lot of Southern Empire. For the assist man, three, two, one, switch and Is it true you're part of the largest mob family in Texas? Then what are you here for? Since I dropped knocking doors, boy, I saw the vibe. Seen the light, want the paper, can't live with I. Zero and young thug in the studio. They already platinum, you already know. Mike Jones and that Cooper, they done shook hands. You can lay your flex aside if you were. We need more more leaders in the game, bruh. I think, let alone the black community, but in this music game, cause we don't have a lot of leaders up in this motherfucker. Like, we don't have a lot of leadership. Everybody's trying to outdo the next. But it's very few people like Pimp C. It's like, my nigga, fuck the competition, my nigga. What competition? We from the same area, my nigga. We from the same region, bro. We could all eat. There's enough money out here for a motherfucking body. But not a lot of people see that picture let alone in life and the music industry and i just think if we had a lot more OGs around a lot more structure a lot more guidance this industry would be different we wouldn't have a lot of this bullshit that's going on this motherfucker my nigga but to each his own my nigga left us a blueprint and so did nipsey is that just to follow the motherfucking instructions because that's all i'm saying I drive knocking doors, boy, I saw the vibe. Seen the light, want the paper, can't live with I. Zero and young thug in the studio. They already platinum, you already know. Mike Jones and that Cooper, they done shook hands. You can lay your flex aside if you a real man. I think that Paul and Chameleon talking but ain't rapping yet. It's a start, though. We're knocking down doors. T.I. flip still on that boy stuff. Acting like kids, that ain't what time it is. No, you don't like what I'm telling you, but I keep it real. How you feel? That's what I'm telling you. Stop listening to what your homeboy is telling you, cause when it pop off, they gonna be bailing fool, and you gonna be alone when you catch the case. So watch your mouth and get that stupid look up off your face. Off, they gonna be bailing fool, and you gonna be alone when you catch the case. So watch your mouth and get that stupid look up off your face. Definitely well received and well needed. Cause like I said, this this industry is for the birds. At the end of the day, when you 
look around and you see what's going on. Like I said, it's a lack of structure, a lack of guidance, a lack of realness, just everything is gimmicks and bubble gum and walk the fuck down. Still select few real ones left that's trying to hold on to the holding on, you smell me, but I digress. But anyway though, my nigga, scrape y'all that, scrape y'all that. Get in the comment box, like, subscribe to the motherfucking YouTube channel, mate. Tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to the YouTube channel. You rock with my nigga Pimp C? Definitely subscribe to the YouTube channel. LB, but what's the deal? And I'm gone. Two. Uh. Do it live for the dead homies. Fuck you and your dead homies. I put dead homies on your head, homie. Appeal money for the fair homies.